Hey everyone, so for my video today, I'm going to do a nail polish collection video. So I'm going to show you what I keep it in. It's really heavy. I keep it in this case, thingamabob. And I, it seems like I have a lot of nail polish, but then, I don't know, I was painting my nails today and I couldn't find any colors that I like, so. But I'll show you what I painted them. It's the sparkly gold nail polish, and it changes color in the sun. I'll show you that one, too, so. Alright, I'm just going to pull them out and tell you guys what they are. First of all, I have on the top, I have these um makeup wedges thingies. Because I wanted to try and do, like, I don't know if you've ever seen it, but, like, kind of, I don't know if it's ombre or what. Well, no, you just take different colors on, you paint different colors on the makeup sponge. And then you kind of stamp it onto your nail, and it looks really cool and stuff. But these didn't work. So they're, they're just in there now. So, yeah. Next, I have this, um, Zoya nail polish remover. This is the bomb.com. Who says that anymore? Nobody. Just, just me. It's just me. It's just me. Anyway. Um, it's, you know at the nail salon how they have like those, um, silver like containers with a nail polish remover in it? And you just take the, um, the, you just take your, um, cotton ball or whatever you're using and press down on it and it, it comes up out of the middle. And it's just so great. That's what this is obviously. But yeah. And it closes, like, you twist it like this to open it and like that to close it. And, um, it's really, really good at taking off the nail polish. And also it... It does smell like nail polish remover, but it also has like a smell or a hint of like lavender or flowers or something like that. And it smells really good. Like it leaves like an after scent in your room or whatever of um of like flowers or lavender, but it's really it's really awesome. It's by Zoya. I don't know if I said that, but you should pick yourself up some. And then I have just this um Rite Aid nail polish remover that only has like a tiny bit in it. I have this in here for like if I get a whole bunch around my nail. Um I just take a um cotton swab and dip it in here and take it off, take the nail polish off of, around my nail. And then I have a bag. It's like got a, a big hole in it because my doll got a hold of it, of course. Alright, so in this bag I have I got a text. Oh, it's my friend Sarah. She texted me. Let's see what she said. She said, great, I love them. She's talking about my vlogs. If you haven't watched them, go watch them. Well, if you want to. Okay, anyway, in this bag I have, um, the cotton pads to use with this to take off my nail polish. And then I also have some foil, because if you have, like, glitter nail polish or, like, really tough to get off nail polish, you just take, um, you've probably heard this before, but you just take a cotton swab thingy and you put nail polish remover on it and then lay it over your finger and wrap it up with this and leave it there for, like, I don't know, five minutes, and then you just take it and pull it off like that, and it gets the nail polish off, and it's great. So, I have some of those, like, extra ones in my, in this bag here. And I also have these, like, these came with nail art, um, nail art, like, nail polish, like this, because it's, like, got a thin brush, but, um, nail stripers, that's what they're called. And you put, lay them on your nail, these things on your nail, and then paint over it, inside it, but... They didn't work very well, so they're just kind of hanging out in there. Then I have these two um, nail filers. Nail filers. But I I hate nail files. Like, I hate filing my nails. Oh, I hate it so much. Just It's like all like gritty and... Oh, I don't know how to explain it, but it just gives me chills because... um I don't know. It reminds me of nails on a chalkboard and I hate it so much. That's seriously the worst. Makes me cringe. Okay. Then I also have... I have the cotton swabs in here. Or what are these called? Q-tips. And then I have... This is a um, bobby pin that I opened up to use for nail art sometimes. And then I also have these... Um, what are they called? Why can't I think of the names of anything? Toothpicks. I have those in there for that too. And a pair of nail clippers. And then I have this thing that came with... I don't know what brand, but some kind of nail sticker thingies to put them on, whatever. But yeah, that was in that bag. And now I'm going to show you all of my nail polishes, which is a lot. Alright, so first of all, I'll show you um, this. I got this like a long time ago, and I've used these, and I like them a lot. They're the Sally Hansen Salon Effects Real Nail Polish Strips. So, I'm sure most people know what these are, but you just 
peel them and stick them on your nail and then you file the extra off and they're really really like awesome and I love them and they come in a whole bunch of different patterns and stuff and they're just so great but I just haven't used this one yet so it's been in there for a long time where to start okay I'll just start with this I got this at I think I got it at Rite Aid and I don't even know what brand it is or what but it's like it's pretty neat I don't really use it that often but you press the see it has a little like needle-y type thing there not a needle but and you squeeze the nail polish and it, it comes out the end of the needle and it's like a really precise thing for like nail art and stuff and it's like that on both sides and also you twist it off and it has a thing in it a, a brush so I thought that was pretty nifty and yes and then here this is the nail striper that I was showing you before it's by Sinful Colors. Does it have a color name? I don't think. Simple but fun. So yeah, here. I'll show you the brush. See? Yeah. And here's another nail striper. The, my nail polish is just thrown in here randomly, but I'm gonna just kind of... So I'm just gonna show you randomly, but... Here's another one. It's Kiss Nail Art Paint. This is what these, um came with this came in a pack of three and these came with it too so I'll show you the tip on this one because it's different I love this nail polish because like the glitter is like super fine and it, it it's really nice but I don't know if these have a name all right well I don't think so and then this is the top coat I'm using right now it is not my favorite it's just leftover so I'm using it and it's kind of hard to get out now because it's down to there but it's Sally Hansen hard as nails and I think it's pretty old but my favorite is, I don't know what brand it is, I think it's Sally Hansen, but it comes in the red bottle, and it's the fast drying top coat, and it is so amazing, it's like anti-chip, I don't know, it, it's not really that great on anti-chipping, but it dries really fast, and it, it's really, really nice, so pick yourself up some of that, but I ran out of that, and I'm like really upset, because it's my favorite. Alright, next one I see is this Essie, and it's called, it's Dive Bar. And it's so pretty. It's like, I hope you guys can see because this camera does not focus. Um, it's got like, it's basically blue. Like it has a whole bunch of different colors. Purple, blue, green, all those colors. And it's so pretty. But yeah, that's Dive Bar. Here's the one that I have on my nails right now. This is by, this is from Del Sol, which it changes color in the sun. And this is the color that it changes to right there starry night it says and this one is oh it's just starry night but yeah i got this in the outer banks and um they have a whole store there of del sol stuff and they all change color in the sun and it's really really cool so that's what i have on my nails right now this is going to be a really long video i just realized how long it's going to be okay this is orally jealous much it's a pretty color um this one is Nicole by OPI, Rainbow in the Skyly. It was the Kardashian collection. Yeah, okay. And then here, I, this is a Sonia Kasha color in... I don't know. Oh, 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 there it is. Blank Slate. Oops. This is an SC color in... Oh, the name rubbed off. Oh, no, 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 it's Heavenly Sunset. Alright, there you go. Next, I have a Zoya color, which is Zoya and Essie are my favorite. Oh, and, and Orly. They're my three favorite um, nail polish brands. This one is Trixie. It's a really nice silver. And then I got, I have a whole bunch. It came in a set of, these are e.l.f. In case you didn't see e.l.f. It came in a set of 15. And so, yeah, these are two of the colors. Do they have names? Yep. This one is Dazzle Diva, and this one is Green Machine. I hope you guys can see. Hmm. Okay, here's some more of them. This one is Violet Velvet. This one my dog got a hold of, of course. And it's Taupe of the World. Here's another one. This is, this is I think, an old one. It's Pure Ice, and it's in French Kiss. And I really like this color. It's really... Um, bright blue kind of but um here's another nail striper that has nail polish on it yeah it's just that um this one is Essie nothing else metals and this is so pretty 
It's purple, chrome, purple. Yes, I love it. Here's one that my friend got me for Christmas, and it's Funky Fingers in Riot. Yep. Here is Sally Hansen Hard as Nails Extreme Wear in do 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 do, and the color's not on it. It must have came off. But I got this one on clearance, but yeah, it's that color. I don't know what the name of it is. Wait, there it is. Rogue Rebel. Is that that word? Yes. I found it. Cool. Okay, and this is an NYC color in Times Square. It's like kind of the same color, but yeah. Mm, what else? This is like a really old color from my, my mom had it when she, I guess, was a kid. I don't know. Maybe she didn't have it when she was a kid. But anyway, she was going through her stuff and found this. And I was like, yeah, that's cool. I'll have that. And it's Sally Hansen Crystal Cl Chrome. It says nail makeup, but it doesn't even look like the bottle at all. Yeah. I don't know. Here's another really old one from her. And it's like really... Ooh, that smelled weird. And it's like really liquidy. And it's Sally Hansen Super Strong Microfiber Base Coat. There you go. I've never used it, so... This I got from Urban Outfitters. And, the, and I also had one that green color. Well, yeah, as you can see, it broke and spilled. This one is Binge. It's really pretty. I love that color. Here is... I don't even know what brand this is, or what the name of it is, but it's just a red. I think it's pretty old. This is a glow-in-the-dark color. It's all separated. It says blue with glitter. Ooh, I think it dried out. No, it's just chunky. I don't know. It's not. It's old, so. Here's another glow-in-the-dark. This is Salon Perfect, and it's all... It's all, um, separated, but... Yeah, it's just a glow-in-the-dark color. It's really cool. Here is um, Sally Hansen Hard as Nails Extreme Wear in green with NV. Yes, I like that color. This one is Revlon. I don't know what it is. Color or something. I don't know because the clearance sticker is covering it up. And the name is Sorbet. I have, this is Sally Hansen Hard as Nails Extreme Wear again in Coral Reef. I like that color a lot. So pretty. Here's another one, Sally Hansen Hard as Nails Extreme Wear in Violet Voltage. This one is separated Revlon Top Speed. Um, and this one's called Lily, and I got it because, well, it's purple and I love purple, but also because um, my dog's name is Lily, so yeah, I had to buy that. No one else. Here's the other one that my friend got me for Christmas. It's Funky Fingers, and it's um. Neon Purple Crackle. It's a crackle top coat. And this one is Pure Ice in... Pure Ice Cheatin'. It's in Cheatin', I, yeah. Like cheating, but without the G. They're cool. Here is Sally Hansen Hard as Nails Extreme Art again in Flirt. I think it's just a... It's a really deep purple. Oh, it's got sparkles in it, too. I doubt you can see it, but it's really pretty. Flirt, yeah. I didn't know if I said the color name. This is a pure ice A list. I was gonna say a list. I was like, what? A list. Um, this is nail savvy. This is really, really old. What color is this? I don't know if it has a name, but yeah, it's just blue with like silver sparkles. Here is sinful colors in Irish green. Really pretty. What else can I find? Oh, here's like a really, really old one. This is Estee Lauder in ginger. Look at that. That's funny. But yeah, it, it's a pretty color. Here's another one of those um, nail stripers. It's pink. Rose in your nose. <laughs> That's funny. It's sinful colors if I didn't say that. Um, here's some of the elf ones. This one is gold star. And this one is sea escape. This one has it's blue with sparkles in it. It's hard to tell, but yeah. This one here is Sally Hansen Complete Salon Manicure in Angel Wings. Ooh, it's really iridescent and pretty. Here's Sally Hansen Hard as Nails Extreme Wear in the color Rockstar Pink. Yeah, I like this one a lot. I got this one for 4th of July because it, it's red and blue. 
This one is um, Sinful Colors, Sinfully Mag Magnetic. And you, it came with a magnet. I don't know where it is. Oh, here it is. Look at that. But you paint it on and then before it dries, you put the magnet up to it like that. And then it gets like a, a pattern like that. And what's the color name? Change it up or charge it up. Charge it up. Yeah, it's pretty. Um, this is another old one. It's Maybelline Express Finish. New shade, apparently. And go, go green. Da -da. Um, what else? Here is, oh, Gap Colors. Oh my gosh, it's so funny. It's really old. It's in Wisteria. Yeah, but it's a pretty color. This is a Sally Hansen Crackle one in the color vintage violet yeah I don't even know if it's any good anymore because it's all separated but here's an Essie color I love this color in leading lady it's like so it's a deep red sparkly one yeah. this is an oh a hair oily ridge filler um base thingy it, it works really nice and here's some more of the elf ones. This one is in Cherry Bomb. And this one is in Glamour Girl. Sparkly. Here's another um, Del Sol one. This one is like pink with like purple shimmer. I don't know. Purple iridescent color-y thing. And it changes to this. It's called Secret Crush and it changes to this purple color there. Um, ooh, this one doesn't look any good anymore, but I'm going to shake it. Um, this is Sally Hansen Hard as Nails Extreme Wear in Marine Scene. This, I remember this nail polish, like, when I first got it, it was, um, it was, like, one of the first nail polishes, like, I remember buying. Well, I didn't buy it, but my mom did, but I don't know what I'm trying to say, but I just remember this one a lot. This is, um, Nicole by OPI Nick Sticks. I don't know why it's called that, but, um... You just push the bottom, and I've had this, I had this a long time ago, got this a long time ago, and it's a brush like that, and it's kind of icky now, and I should probably throw it away, but it's really old, and the lid won't go, oh, there it is, okay. This is Nails Ink London Magnetic Nail Polish, and it's like the other one that I showed you, and the magnet's up there. It's pretty purple, shimmery purple. Here's another old one, and it doesn't have a name, apparently, I don't really know, but it's a blue color. Here's a, this is a crackle one, so it's each shook and shaken up, shooken. Um, it's Nails Ink Special Effects. It's a crackle. This was the first crackle that I ever got. Woo, I got it at Sephora. Um, I love this color. This is LA Colors Color Craze in Confetti? I don't know. That's all it says, confetti, but it's so pretty. It has like rainbow big sparkles and then like um like little tiny silver sparkles yeah this one i love too this is piggy polish in and i don't think it has a name that's so disappointing yeah it doesn't have a name but it's got mostly blue small blue sparkles and then it has some bigger um gold sparkles and some like long rectangular pink sparkles and it's really cool. I love it so much. What else? All the most of the other ones are like these really old nail polishes, but it's alright. Um this is Sally Hansen Diamond Strength. It says no chip nail color. This is in diamonds, go figure. Here's another elf one. Ready? Oh, red E or not. Uh -huh, so funny. It's a nice deep red iridescent. Um, this is a L'Oreal color in Orange You Jealous. I like that one a lot. Here's a, ooh, I love this one. I forgot I had this one. I never used this. Oh, I love it. This is China Glaze Glitter All The Way. It's so awesome. It has, let's see, purple, gold, green, and red sparkles. It's so cool. Here's another elf one in Chic Confetti. It's like not shook enough. It's just different color. 
sparkles. Here is Sally Hansen Gem Crush in Lady Luck. Here's another one, Sally Hansen Gem Crush in Big Money in each shaken. This one's really pretty. It's got gold and pink sparkles in it. Here, this one's really pretty. I love this. Nicole by OPI in a, win a gold winter's night. And it has green, purple, and gold um, sparkles, like the long rectangular sparkles. Here's a top coat. New NYC, New York. NYC top coat. I should keep that at the top. At the top, because it's a top coat. Here's another elf color. Desert Haze. That one's nice. Taupe. I was going to put it up there. Another elf one. In Blushing Beauty. Yeah, iridescent. Another elf one. In Smoky Brown. Ooh. I don't know. Here's a Sally Hansen Hard as Nails Extreme Wear. Or, yeah, Extreme Wear. In Blizzard Blue. Pretty. Look at these two. These two are like the same exact color. This one's Marine Scene and this one's Blizzard Blue. Look at they look the exact same. This one's a little bit darker. Here's another Sally, or Sinful Colors Nail Art one. It's like an extremely bright yellow. And what else? Here's Sinful Colors. What color is this? 24-7. Bright pink. Mm, this one is Orly Color Blast. In apparently no color. No name, I mean. But yeah, it's um, really, really pretty. It's like green, gold, and pink. I, I wish I could think of what this is called. Like, where it has, like, a whole bunch of different colors. No, Like, whatever way you turn it, it looks different. Whatever, you know. This is a Deb nail color. Look at that. Going old school. This one is... Style number 2000. Guess it doesn't have a name. Oh, there it is. Imperial Violet. Yep. This is an Essie color in... Smooth Sailing. Really pretty. Got It has little shimmers in it. I don't know. This is like one of my favorites. This is Zoya um, NV. I love this color so much. Here is OPI yeah OPI in Divine Swine. My mom got me this for Christmas because she's like she loves pigs like she's loved pigs forever. She's like obsessed with pigs and Divine Swine. That's a pig and it's pink and it's so cute. It's got like pink, little tiny pink sparkles and big um, silver ones. Yes, so pretty. I love it. Here's a nails ink. It's 3D glitter. It might even, or oh, I can't even open it. Nope, can't open it. It's in Bloomsbury or Bloomsbury. I don't know how to say it. Square. Here you can see it. I bet you can't see it, but yeah. Yep. Pretty. Here's a Sinful Colors in Mint Apple. I love the name of it. And yep, pretty. Here's another Essie in... Oh, Main Squeeze. I was like 712. What the heck? Main Squeeze. This one's really pretty. Iridescent, purpley. Yes, I like that one a lot. Here's another Essie in Pilates Hottie. Yeah. Pretty. What else? All the other ones are like really older stuff. Not all of them, because here's the Zoya one in Doll. I think it is D-A-U-L. But, yeah, I love this one. I love Zoya nail polish. I find it. I found it at Ulta. I, I've heard of it, and then I had heard of it, and then I couldn't find it anywhere, and I was so upset, and then our Ulta opened. Yeah, we kind of just got it, like, I don't know when, but. It's recently new, kind of, sort of. But anyway, and then it opened and I found it and I was like, oh my gosh. I literally, like, screamed, oh my gosh, in the store. Um, Kiss Nail Art in this green color. I don't think they have names, but yeah. Here's another L'Oreal one in Club Prive. I don't know, but yeah. It's really pretty. I love it. Here's another um Kiss Nail Art in black. This is a another hair. Green tea plus bamboo strengthener by Sally Hansen. Yeah. 
I don't really know how this works. I used it like once, but it, it didn't really do much. Else. Here's Sally Hansen Hard as Nails Extreme Wear in purple pizzazz. It's like just purple with purple sparkles. Here's some NYC colors. This one is cashmere cream. Oh, there. Are, I guess they all say cream, and this one's yellow taxi cream. I don't know. This one is an. Okay, I'm gonna have the discussion. Aero pastel, which is what I think it is, Aero pastel, or Aero pastel. It's not Aero pastel, everybody. It's Aero pastel. End of discussion. Okay. Well, I got this at Aero pastel, and it's fa la 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 la, because it was for Christmas, and it's just green sparkles and it's pretty. I never wore it though. And this is sinful colors, easy going. It's just a really pale pink, and it's pretty. Um, here is Sally Hansen Artist Nails Extreme Wear in white on. Yeah, white on. I remember I didn't like this one that much when I used it, but it is what it is. It's the only white nail polish that I have besides this striper. And this is Sephora by OPI in Mermaid to Order. Now this is like, this color my mom is like obsessed with. She tries to find colors for some reason that like, outdo this one and she's like oh that one's almost like my mermaid to order but not as good blah 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 she always talks about it it's like hilarious and we've had this forever why is she barking that's lily barking i don't know what she's barking at but here's a pure ice in this is one of the first nail polishes i remember too in flirt alert oh i love this one this is orly in royal navy so flipping pretty just blue with blue sparkles here's an elf one but different um, I don't think I ever used this one what's the color I don't know what the color is but it's like a deep purple with purple and blue sparkles I doubt you can see because this camera sucks it doesn't really because it's waterproof and it's really cool but this is colorama in black on oh no black magic black on what the heck Here's like another really old one. It's Revlon Super Top Speed Chrome. And it's in khaki chrome. Yeah, I'm gonna see what it looks like. Yep, pretty true to color. True to the bottle or whatever. Um here is another top coat. Sally Hansen Hard as Nails Top Coat Extreme Wear. Invisible! I'm gonna put that up here because I need top coats. And then this is um, a matte top coat by NYC. These things are awesome. Mattifying top coats. Yep. I love them. Um, this is a Colorama. In, oh, this is by Maybelline. I didn't know that. These are by Maybelline. Maybelline Colorama. Um, this one's in... Oh, here it is. Turquoise Seas. I gotta hurry up. My foot is falling asleep. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is Sally Hansen Complete Salon Manicure in Loves Me Not, and it's it's kind of like that other, like, I don't know what the word is, but it, it, it's got green in it and purple and blue, and it's so pretty, and it's got sparkles. This one is Sally Hansen Diamond Strength in Precious Peach. It's kind of, yeah, it's got tiny sparkles in it. Okay. Oh no, there's one more. This one is Essie San Tropez, I think is how you say it. This is the first Essie nail polish that I ever had, and I love it. This is another really old one. This is Wet and Wild. Lily's barking some more, and I don't know what she's barking. Oh, I think she wants pizza. Alright, this is Wet and Wild in 423B. That's exciting. But this is, like, extremely old. You're not going to find this anywhere, probably. Well, you're not, but, yeah. Here's another nail striper. Let's see. Oh, this is, um, I, I doubt this works anymore because Lily got a, oh, my might. Got a hold of the lid, but it's a nail art pen in white. Who's a pie? Sally Hansen. Let's see. Oh, here's another e.l.f. nail polish in Misty Haze. Yep. Okay. 
Now, all the other ones are just these random brands, these little tiny nail polishes that I had, like, since I was little, except for some of them. Alright, these are all the random little tiny ones. Most of them are bonbons, like this. See, here's this one. This one's just a random one that I have no idea what it's from. Here's the bonbons. Another bonbons. And then these two, I don't know what they're from. And another bonbons one. And then, what is this? It's, oh, it's a glow-in-the-dark, um, orange color, whatever. And then I have scented nail polish. I have, uh, yeah, I have fun dip ones, but th they're just the kind of nail polish that just peel off right away in, like, these, like, in one, like, peel, whatever. But they're scented, yeah. I wonder if they even work anymore. I doubt it. Let's see. Nope. But they smell so good, so I gotta keep them. I think I got these, or at least one of these I got in, I think, I think it was the Laffy Taffy ones, these ones. Um, my dad got for me in New York City when we went for my birthday. And yeah, so here's the Laffy Taffy ones. There's strawberry, blue, wild blue raspberry, cherry, banana, and grape. And... I'm gonna go ahead and tell you this hilarious story, but when we were in, well, I'm pretty, yeah, it was when we were in New York, I, I took some friends, and my one friend Sarah, she was in my best friend tag video, alright, I'm gonna tell you this, we, um, we took these, and we painted on our stomachs with them, and then peeled them off, can't believe I just told you that, but yeah, they came off, it came off in like, one, like, peel and it was just so exciting because we painted pictures on our belly and then peeled it off don't judge me okay guys so that's all of my nail polish i'm now covered in nail polish and i hope this video isn't like way too long it probably will be but i'll try and edit it and make it shorter anyway so thank you guys for watching and i'll see you next time bye